Hey, are you a pole vaulter? Do you know somebody that is a pole vaulter? Well, in this video, I'm going to be sharing with you my top 10 essentials for what every pole vaulter needs in their meat bag. Coming in at number 10, but certainly not least, an arm pad. Sometimes when I pole vault, my bottom arm rubs up against the pole. This keeps it from bruising. And if you're someone like me, who makes contact with the pole with their shins, it can also be used as a shin guard. Coming in at number 9, something that I use at every single practice in me, chalk. Or if you're a sticky spray person, use sticky spray. The confidence that chalk or sticky spray can give you is the difference between making and breaking at your next attempt. Now coming in at number 8, this one is crucial for most athletes to perform. It's snacks. What I have in my hand? A giant jar of honey. I like to use honey in my track meets. You can grab stuff like bananas, granola bars, sandwiches, whatever you feel like. Keep going at the meet. Number 7 on the list, I have a spare bungee. Say you're at the biggest meet of the year and a cake goes up, breaks the bungee in warm-ups. What do you do? You now become everyone's best friend because you came prepared with an extra bungee. At number six on my list, I have something that can help you when the weather goes bad, a towel. You can use the towel to keep you and your hand grips dry during the middle of the meet. At number five on my list, I have backup clothes. If the weather goes bad, you get soaked, you're in between events, you kind of smell from competing all day. Which, I'm not going to lie, I stink sometimes when I compete. It's great to have a backup set of socks, backup shirt, backup pants for when you're done with your event or if you're ready to get out of your uniform. Coming in at number four on my list is one of the most overlooked things people don't put in their bag, a tape measure. Let's say you get to a meet, you expect there to be a tape measure on the runway ready to go. Well, what if there isn't? Now instead of everyone guessing where their steps are, you can be the hero of the day and become everybody's friend. At number three, we have something that's really gonna help you keep track of your steps and your grip and your run and your poles. It's a journal. Now I know most people nowadays keep track of their numbers in their phone. But at most high school track meets and college track meets, phones are illegal on the infield. But journals aren't. That's a great way for you to access your numbers without potentially getting disqualified from the pole vault. And coming in at number two is something that 99.99996% of all pole vaulters use. Tape. Every vaulter has tape on their pole. So this is a great way to make best friends at a track meet. If you show up to a track meet prepared with a couple extra rolls of tape, everyone there is going to love you. Trust me. And coming in at number one on my list, which is the most obvious and most crucial, are your track spikes. These things are the magic that get you to run faster down the runway. I don't know if that's actually true, but it sounds right. Hey, thanks for watching the video. I hope this video has given you a little more guidance as to what you should have in your meat bag to be more prepared at your next track meet. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like, subscribe, share it. I want this kind of information to be out for everyone. The more people that can see it, the better informed the pole vault community is as a whole. And I guess this is the end of the video, so like most pole vaulters, this is where I take off.